What's going on guys? In this video we are going to talk about face centered cubic structure. Here we have a face centered cubic structure and uh, for a face centered cubic structure there are four atoms per unit cell. Okay, four atoms per unit cell. Now let's see how it is. Each side you can see there are eight corners. Each corner is one eighth of the atom. Okay, each corner is one eighth of the atom. So one over eight times here we have 8 corner for a cube so 1 over 8 times 8 and also this dark blue color represents half of the atom so here we have 6 faces for a cube each face has a half of an atom so it means half times 6 that's going to give us 1 plus 3 that's equal to 4 that's how we got 4 atoms per unit cell and also we have to know the coordination number of a face centered unit I mean face centered cubic structure the coordination number is equal to 12. Coordination number is basically how many atom is connected for a one atom like how many atoms are connected with one atom. Now let's see how we got 12. Okay in order to show that one I have to draw this cube separately. Okay, Let's draw a cube right here. Here we have a cube and uh, it's going to be like this okay so this is our cube and uh, let's look at one corner in one corner we have half of uh, atom and each corner we have one eighth of the atom this is connected with all of these four in one corner right so totally we this this middle atom is connected with four atoms so we can put four and also we have to know the other corner we have a half of atom right in other face the face that is opposite to this one we have a half of an atom but this atom will not connect with this one that's the only thing we have to know so this will not connect but this will connect with the half of the atom in the other faces other faces except this one in the opposite side okay so we have one on the top one on the bottom plus two let's draw something with a different color so this one top and bottom and also in the other side and this side we have 2 plus 2 and we have 4 plus 2 6 6 plus 2 8 we have to have 4 more right the 4 more come from other another cubic structure so here we have another cube if you take another cube connect with this one okay so let's connect this one another cube connected with this one for this cube this also going to the opposite side will not connect with this one right for this one also opposite will not connect but this side has one this side has one plus two and the bottom has one top has one that's two so totally we have four plus two six six plus two eight eight plus two ten ten plus two twelve that's how we got twelve coordination number this atom in this one is connected with 12 of these atoms and that's how we got coordination number 12 okay and the next thing we have to know is the edge length now let's get rid of this part okay edge length for a face centered cubic structure is given by x is equal to square root of 8 r now let's see how we derive this one if you look at one face of this cube structure this represents the rad radius is r so the diameter is going to be 2r right and from here to here it's r and here to here it's r so from this corner this corner right here to this corner total distance is 4r and when we say h length we are talking about this distance right for a cube this distance is equal in each side so this is also x this height also x all of them are x right now we are interested in proving this x is equal to square root of 8r and we found out this diagonal is equal to 4r and if you use Pythagorean theorem because for a cube this is going to be 90 degree so we can say 4r square is equal to x square plus x square okay 4r square is what like 4r 4 square 16 r square plus x square plus x square 
that is equal to 2x square therefore x square is going to be 8 r square therefore x is going to be square root of 8 r and that's how we got x is equal to square root of 8 r okay that is about h length now let's see how much percentage of the this cube is occupied by the atoms for a face centered cubic structure 74 percentage is occupied by the atoms now let's prove this one in order to prove this one i have to use this equation v atom over v cube okay v atom atom is a spherical shape there are four atoms for a, four atoms in a unit cell for a face centered cubic structure so we have to multiply by 4 times for a spherical shape the volume is given by 4 over 3 phi r cube okay and v cube v cube since it's a cube the volume is going to be x cube right and we already found out h length x is given by square root of 8 r so we can replace this x cube with square root of 8 r and this is cube right x is equal to this one so this is cube let's try to write this one in a better way and if we write this one like 4 we can write this one as 4 times 4 and I'm separating this 4 over 3 like 4 times 1 over 3 times 5 r cube divided by square root of 8 cube square root of 8 cube is basically square root of 8 multiplied by 3 times so when we multiply square root of 8 2 times that's going to be 8 and square root of 8 square root of 8 we can write it as 4 times 2 right and 4 square root of 4 is equal to 2 so we can take this 2 outside and 2 multiplied by 8 that's going to give us 6 so 6 square root of 2 is equivalent to square root of 8 cube so we can replace this square root of 8 cube with 6 square root of 2 times r cube and here you can see this r cube r cube cancels and this 16 and 4 times 4 is going to cancel and finally we will end up with 5 over 3 root 2 and if you calculate this value you are going to get 0 0.7404 and if you express this one in percentage you are going to get 74.04 percentage in other words we can approximately say 74 percentage of this cube is occupied by the atoms and those are some basic stuff you have to know about phase centered cubic structure. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.